taking a look at the progression of our development in terms of working the pieces together more effectively and safer. That being said, it all depends on what the opponent actually does because we're always constantly responding to whatever the opponent does and that's what it takes whether you get a high accuracy or a low accuracy in the game. So I'm going to attack the bishop, just keep it all simple, straightforward. We're definitely not taking. Why? Because we don't want to open this, because then the rook has this, and the queen has this, and then the knight has this, all bearing down on this pawn here. So we're not going to take that. So we're going to castle though. Keep it nice and safe. The king. Now we've got to try and see whether or not we can keep the king company, but for now what I'm going to do is just push through, try and obliterate this centre if we can. If we have to lock down then I suppose in a way it's an option. And yeah, I think they're probably wanting us to push there, so I'm going to actually take on this occasion. Seeing as they're not wanting to play a ball and they're wanting us to push there, so they see how slowly they move then because they didn't expect that. I'm actually going to bring the knight across. I want to maybe try and get my knight across here to give my king some company. Don't really want to expand it, expand it out anyway. So now they're coming chasing our um, queen x-ray through type thing. Still looking for this type of stuff. Still look, looking to get the knight across here. We need to give our king company. And I think they probably realise that we are attempting to do that. So then if they took, then they'd open up the pawn in front because our queen wouldn't be able to take them back. Whew. So we have to change the attack a little bit now. We do have a potential option here of attacking this pawn because we have the knight and we have the bishop. If the queen takes, we, if the bishop takes, we can take back. His knight may still jump here, still thinking he's coming here with the support from the queen. So I'm actually going to push through the centre here, try and open it up a bit more, make some space for our rooks, etc. And it's gone quiet. <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to take, because we're on the queen as well, so I'm assuming they're going to take back with the knight. They're so focused on this pawn. Um, so he's on our queen, but we get his queen with a check. So he has to do something about the check. His king obviously is going to come here, so we're not going to be a piece up. Oh, and they've resigned. I was just flowing quite nicely, knowing we've won the tempo here. The king has to um, come and attack, I suppose. I'm assuming if it does do that. Obviously, we do have space for the check to be coming here, but if we then took his... So, we've got a queen, and they haven't got a queen, so that's probably why they... Yeah, okay, fair enough. 